Hi, another topic today is about round robin tournament. Round robin tournament is a type of tournament wherein a team has an opportunity to play with other teams. And to find out the winner here is depend on the number of wins in rounds. The formula of our round robin tournament is G equals N times N minus 1 divided by 2. Remember that our N stands for participants. Teams, competitors, whereas divided by 2 is constant and even minus 1. So G stands for games or number of games. How do we know if we have buy in this tournament as long as the number is odd, meaning the number of participants. Odd number example is one, three, five, seven. So, meaning if the number is odd, we have only one buy. If the number is even, like 2, 4, 6, 8, then no buy. So round robin is done in a counterclockwise manner. So the teams, competitors, or players will be having their play in a counterclockwise manner. Must be done. In a counter clockwise manner. Okay. Supposing we have this first example as uh, three teams. In three teams, we have formula G equals N times N minus 1. We have 3. 3 minus 1. This is divide 2. We have 3 times 2 divide 2. So 3 times 2, it's 6 divide 2. So 6 divided by 2, we have three games as we can see here three is odd in other words we have one by so let's proceed to round one this is our round one or we could uh, even uh, write r1 so this is how we place it in a counterclockwise manner so the opposite of our team one if it's odd in number is by meaning our team one cannot play in the first round in other words one will be waiting for the second round two three so this is our game one two versus three now let's proceed to round two so one Always let your team want to stay in play so you won't be confused. But the rest together with your buy will move or will move in a counterclockwise. You have two, three. So this time, team one could already play. This is our game two. I'm gonna write a bar here. So our game two is uh, 
to be played between team 1 versus team 3. And so lastly, let's have round 3. So we have team 1, team 3, we have by and team 2. So basically, this is our game 3 to be played between team 1 versus team 2. Now, how to check this work? Of course, there's no repetition of the counter. Remember that you'll be only facing the other teams once. If it's a double round robin, then every team has a chance to compete twice with the rest of the team. So since this is single round robin, so we will just have one phasing or one match per team. So the last team that our team one will be facing is team two, followed by team three, and then in the first round is bye. Thank you and God bless.